Hello again, friends. It is me, RPG Birdie. Today we have more Septoricor. Pretty sure I didn't say Septoricor correctly. Haha, -ha. alright. We are going into this graveyard today. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Spent an entire part last time just talking to people. That must have been very riveting. Um. My microphone still seemed like a little on the loud side, so I moved it away an inch, and I swear if this is too quiet now I'm gonna just give up on everything. You don't need to be so spacious. That flashing is gonna throw me off. What is- what is that? Oh! Definitely a zombie. Kind of just, uh, slowly making his way downtown, I guess. Jeez, if you're sensitive to flashing lights, maybe this might be a part worth, like, looking away from it. Because even that, like, lightning stuff... <laughs> the lightning stuff kind of annoys me a little bit. Eating up the grass like an acid. Wicked! Too bad we don't have like a flask or something to put that in because I'm pretty sure that's what I need for um, getting that head or whatever taken off that thing. Yeah, it probably goes right on that. Where's the head? some mechanisms inside this statue. Can you activate them? Yeah, I think there's a piece missing. I'll bet the secret lies in the missing head. The missing head sitting in the library that I need the acid to get free. I wonder if I can open that gate. We'll take a look in a second. Locked. Of course it is. Can I take this now? Ooh, what a mess. Probably not. Uh that gravestone is kind of going like over the top of him. You're a robot, you can carry it, maybe. Hmm. Here I was saying we were gonna go to this graveyard next because that seemed like it made sense. But now I'm stumped again. Um, the only thing I can imagine is that just something with a library, probably. That one person in the, uh, farm area was saying something about talking about someone named Carver. I don't know who Carver is though. Nope, not that one. Oh for goodness sake. So do we need to observe the head again? There's an iron collar holding it to the table. Uh, alchemy and modern blah. Blah 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 blah. Foul chemical using its strong cross properties as an acid. I don't think this guy can help me, but I'll ask anyway. Back again? Hmm. 
Oh, wait, I can ask about this headless statue. Do you know anything about the statue in the graveyard? It's the likeness of an ancient necromancer, Drax. The statue was defiled years ago. Its head lies in the library for safekeeping. Some say the head was removed to keep the curse of Drax from animating the statue. <laughs> but that's just a myth. Ugh. Okay. But I need it. I need it to do things. Hey, how's it going? Not a very talkative fellow. I thought maybe he would say something this time. Are you just gonna mention how it's bolted down again? There's an iron collar bolting it to the table. <sighs> All right. <laughs> All right. One moment while I look it up. I'm not wandering aimlessly. I'm not wasting my time, and I'm not wasting your time. Okay. Everything makes sense now. We just gotta go back to the farm. So let me let me, not Lee, let me make my way over there, wasting precious moments once again. Um, I, you're definitely having a time there. All right, I'll just pretend that didn't happen. Oh, dang it, that's weapons. Where's the item shop here? Wait, is it this one? Welcome. Look around. There it is. Oh my gosh, how did I not see there was a key item for sale? Well, the more you know, and in the future, the more you learn. Am I going to fight it again? Nope. Just probably gonna say that it's gross. Okay, let me just... It's full of zombie blood. Yay! Haha. -ha. Haha! -ha. And you, you get some bird seed. Farewell, little bird friend. I think you're just supposed to feed birds that you see. That's a, I think that's a side quest thing now, so if I miss some birds, then I'll be sad, but it's not the end of the world. Okay. Now we run to the back. Again. All the way. We free the head. We take the head. We put the head on the thing. And then... Question mark. I know a light jog is probably better for your stamina or something, but could you please just, for 
for once, just sprint. Stand back. It's mine now. Give me that head. Yay. Also, uh... What are all these, like, attachments for? Protects from undead damage. Uh, hmm. Well, for now, we'll put it on him. We'll give him the thing that ups his HP back once we're done with this graveyard. If I remember. We'll see. Alright. Get excited because now we're actually going to the graveyard. Things are gonna happen. Okay. As long as I don't get caught on things. All right, down we go, over, down, in here. Evil looking statue. Save game, right here, return, back. Head on the statue. We did bad. You said it was mechanical. Or that it had mechanical parts. Is this a robot? I wonder if magic will work on it. That's a lot of zombies. I'm gonna have, like, runner focus on beaming the boss, and I think I should focus on getting rid of these zombies. Uh, I don't know. I'm glad that did exactly what I was hoping it would. Is that a life steal? You can't life steal. Nobody told you that was allowed. Get away from my robot. Need to die faster. Dang it. I'm sure that, like, if I kill all of them, it's going to just frickin' summon more. So maybe I should keep one alive, because I can just have Grub keep using repair on Runner if that zombie is hitting him. Might as well charge up a third beam at this point.
Oh! It died a lot faster than I was thinking it was going to. Well, in any case, I guess we'll just kill the zombie. And call it a day. Wrap it up. Be careful with my targeting because I can see those crosshairs lining up to hurt poor runner. I'll just do a level one beam. Yay! That was a lot of experience. Ooh, earth magic. Everybody have a little bread snack. Actually, hmm. We're in pretty good shape. Nobody gets bread. Nobody needs a bread snack. Why does it... Why does it say it's 4.34 in the morning? I can assure you that it is currently 10.48. That is in a skewed time. Now onto the actual dungeon. I just walked in here. There's no missing. That's not allowed. Every single one needs to take like three tiny baby, mm, tiny baby steps. No. At this point, like the gun is just inside of the zombie. I was hoping that was going to one-shot it. I helped for too much. Frickin' put me to sleep. I wonder if they just do, like, a, a lot of damage or something, because that's the only reason I can think of to have them spend, like, four turns just walking toward you. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I just, like, my brain just shut off. It just completely shut off and I shot him! <laughs> oh, I shot poor runner. Like, I don't- I can't explain it. Like, I'm just tired of this battle. Also, my chair is uncomfy. He deserved that level up, honestly. Don't look at me like that. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. Oh, here, I'll give him a little repair to make up for it. Oh my goodness. That was funny, though. Alright, cool. Nothing there. Oh, please don't be four again. One. One. Well, thank you.
See, it's not so bad if it's just one. In fact, it's it's very easy. Two even is fine. But four is excessive. And it's it's just because they all get their turns around the same time. And so I have to sit there and watch them take like three or four steps. Well, that gives me an idea of how far away that door is. And those stairs, which I assume are the way out. Here comes the battle. Never mind. Here comes the battle. There we go. Three. Uh, okay. Great, there's one for each person. I've got my ideas. As long as they don't walk again. Maya! Why? Haha! -ha, it did hit both. is a little bit of an ouch. No, I'm close enough. There we go. Alright. I think Grub deserves some bread. Haha, -ha, we just got some. It's zombie bread. Enjoy! What? What? What is this? What are these funny- Oh my god, they scream! Screaming, screaming skeleton heads. Oh, good gracious. And there was thunder, too. It's just a noisy, noisy time. take out this one. If I take it out, I mean just deal a tiny bit of damage because it's apparently how it's gonna be. Speaking of tiny damage, thanks. That was nothing. It's not an invitation to do more, though. Eh. You don't get to have turns that fast. That's not how it goes. If I have to suffer an ATB, so do you. Well, it's technically not an ATB. Uh -huh, whatever, I don't care. Oh, I should have just waited for the second bar. Wow, it even plays music when it dies. <laughs> oh, it looks funny. Alright, uh, let's see. And the other two are fine, right? Yes, yes they are. Anything here? Anything I can do with this door? This wall looks unstable. I'll 
bet a well-placed bomb could bring down this whole wall. That's exactly what we need then, a bomb. Wow, color me surprised that we didn't get into a battle in that little run there. What's that? A little bone pit? Guess I can't go that way. Oh, well, it looks like stairs that go up. And this is just more bones and holes? I guess so. Okay. Up we go. Uh, hello. Who are you? There's no time to explain. I've come to warn you of a coup led by Dugan. Dugan? He's in league with the Chosen. Lord Bowman's strange troops assault the streets, and warships have been seen on the horizon. Dugan and his bounty hunters are at the cathedral doors. Retreat through the catacombs. Quick, we must hurry. No, go without me. I'll buy you the time. Never. It's not bad enough running like dogs. You want us to abandon our lord as well? Go. If you stay, we all fall. Layla. The task of leadership now falls to you. Go to the mountains. Don't let the hope of Mardo die. I'll do my best. Take good care of my daughter, Corbin. Yes, sir. Curse you, Deacon. Are you finally satisfied? Cut him down. What are you waiting for? Follow my orders. He's no longer a threat. Why do we have to? I don't see any... Because I pay you good money, dog. Now do as I say. Don't ever question me again. Now find the others. Hunt them down and bring me their bodies. Morgan, we need to split up. The guard will come with me. Go with these outlanders. Meet us at the mountains. And don't be followed. Runner, come back! Grub, we have to get out of here. But... Corgan. Yes? Take care of yourself. And you. Let's go, before those bounty hunters find us. Nah. Wait, what? Okay, what? It just, it kind of, like, showed, uh, Grub was taken out for a second? I was really confused. Okay, well, uh, welcome to the party. We have lots of bread. It looks a little moldy, and some of it might have come from zombies, but it's edible. Uh, we've also got some roots and some potions. So, if you're worried about your health, don't be, because you'll be fine. Okay, well, I guess we're going back through. Gonna have to deal with some screaming skulls again, I'm sure. I definitely have to deal with it. Uh, I just realized that uh, Runner was my, was my fancy beam person. You better be able to hit hard, buddy. Otherwise, you are not making up for anything. It's not as good, but it's still pretty good. And he's faster, so that's good. Lots of good. Good, good, good. Everybody just fend for yourself. We don't have a beam to spray across anymore. You're awfully close. I hate that he strikes twice, but it does damage once. I don't know why, but I remember these zombies being a lot stronger 
Maybe I was just a stupid kid when I was playing. Crap, you only just now hit level 6? Really? Oh, great. Screaming skull time. Always does it right when the thunder happens. Well, I guess since we're all relatively fast, might as well use our threes instead of twos. That wasn't as impressive as I was hoping. I'm starting to think that that thunder is just part of, like, the attack. Yeah, it absolutely is. Okay. Well, mystery solved. so funny when that happens. Alright. I think Maya's earned her bread. I will say that the point click interface makes this a little nicer. We're going this way. I believe the catacombs stretch on here, but I don't see any way through. A bomb. Where are we gonna freaking find a bomb? I'll bet a well-placed bomb could bring down this whole wall. This wall looks unstable. Yes. We have all said our piece about the wall, and I just don't know what else to do about it. The wall has me stumped. And I'll have to figure out what to do to get beyond it. I suppose. Probably have to like leave the graveyard and do stuff elsewhere. But you know what? That's something I'm gonna have to do another time. Because this part has gone on long enough. But it was an interesting one. It's not it's not freaking four fifty one in the morning. I don't know why you think it is. Whatever. Anyway. I hope that you enjoyed this because I mean I'm I'm starting to enjoy the game more minus like my complaints with the battle system but it's like ev everything else I like but yeah I hope that you enjoyed watching as always take care and I will see you next time